a little bit about our BSc uh, Honours program. We are a full-time course. We run over two years. And we build on your pre-registration education. So we're not expecting you to go over the old ground, so to speak. We know that you are registered nurses, and we are actually giving you a range of opportunities to develop your skills, both your clinical skills, your academic skills, but most important, your clinical decision-making skills. We've developed our program in partnership with the Ministry of Health, and we are approved both by the Ministry of Health and the Singapore Nursing Board. In fact, we are being accredited. We are just having an accreditation site visit um, quite in a little while. But the most important thing about our program is that we're preparing you as nurses to meet the challenges and changing healthcare needs here in Singapore. So it is actually a Singapore-based curriculum. And one of the key features of our curriculum is that we're equipping you to be the nurse leaders of tomorrow. And we provide you with an additional opportunity for the Manchester Leadership Program so you can actually go work towards the Manchester Leadership Qualification. We offer a range, of, uh, a range of modules that you may not have looked at in your pre-registration training, such as supportive and palliative care. There is a clinical attachment with this. We also offer a, a, a module in long-term conditions. And we know at the moment we are living in an aging society, uh, both not only in Singapore, but globally. And as nurses, we actually need to look at people as, as, her, as people with a range of different long-term conditions. So what we do in this particular module is we equip you to do in-depth assessment to look at how you can create, you know, give the best evidence-based care for your patients. We also do a module in teaching and assessing in clinical practice. So this is the equivalent of the UK mentorship uh, qualification, although we don't offer that particular qualification, but you are given the skills with you, where you can actually teach um, your juniors, you can also teach patients, and you can actually supervise other learners within your uh, clinical area. And a very important part of being a nurse leader is how you lead and manage change. And we have a specific module that is actually giving you the skills to move forward and to move practice forward. You need to be registered with the Singapore Nursing Board. You need to be a, re a registered nurse and have a recognized polytechnic diploma in nursing. You also need a GPA of three or above. We offer a range of scholarships, and I'll be talking a little bit about those. And for people who want scholarships, we are looking for a GPA of 3.5. But anyone with a GPA of 3, please, uh, please uh, apply. So these are the level of credits that you need for our course, which is why it's a two-year course. We give you advanced standing as polytechnic uh, students for the first year of our BSc um, nursing uh, BSc Honours Nursing Practice. You then need to do 120 cre cre credits for Year 2 and 120 credits for Year 3. And we guide you through each of, those, each of those years and help you develop your critical analytical skills so that you are moving forward. So each of those areas is a step up. Nursing now is moving into the 21st century. And as such, we need to make sure we give our patients the best care based on the best evidence. You will be supported to be developing your critical um, decision-making skills through the evidence-based nursing, where you look at the research and you can make the decisions based on that research. And that's a key, a key um, factor now in all nurse, uh, in good nursing care. But of course, what is most important and what most students like to know is, well, what about the Overseas Immersion Program when you come to visit us at the University of Manchester? Okay, it's, a four weeks, it's four weeks long, and there's a whole range of activities that we put into that. There are structured field visits, and these can be in hospitals. We take you to uh, the world-class Christie Hospital, which is a re renowned, internationally renowned cancer, tertiary, uh, cancer hospital, which is a tertiary center. There are opportunities to go and see dementia specialist uh, environments, district general hospitals, as well as the main Manchester teaching hospitals. We arrange uh, conferences for you, again, usually based in the Christie Hospital. 
You have um, opportunity to work alongside um, UK nursing students, and there's also the volunteering and leadership challenges. Manchester Leadership Programme is actually also about volunteering, and there's a whole range, of course, of social events, and most of our students say they love the shopping in Manchester. We also try and take you to a few cultural environments as well. You have the opportunity of um, also doing the Leadership in Action unit, and for that, we actually expose you to world-class leaders in the areas such as looking at global poverty, global warming, sustainability, things that we as nurses need to know if we're going to be leading change into the 21st century. So we have, very high, um, we have a very high level of candidates and we have, very, um, you know, we have excellent uh, nurses on our courses. And we will welcome you to join our very high caliber of nursing students.